hello welcome back to my channel i'm your girl sincerely kso thank you so much for coming back to me i appreciate it um we've got a voted reaction and this is firefly you guys wanted me to watch the whole season so we'll be doing that i hope you enjoy it thank you so much for just sticking with me guys i know it's been a hell of the ride of a ride um you if you're new to this channel then you probably don't know that this started out being a music reaction channel um i got two strikes from the same reactor yes a reactor found a way to get me two strikes on videos that are up and when i discussed with other reactors they just put two and two together told me i was being targeted by this lady i don't know why and i really don't care however i decided i wasn't going to give anyone any more ammunition to try to take down down this channel so while I'm still doing music reaction, I put it up on a backup channel. Till the strikes are out on this channel, I will not be uploading music reactions. That's why I'm uploading um, series, just things to keep us, other things to keep us entertained that you might enjoy that I want to watch as well. So I'm watching it with you. The backup channel is alive and well and it's kicking and it's it's up with music but until the two strikes are out on this channel i will not be uploading music so i really want to thank you guys for being very understanding very patient with me it can't be easy i know i know you love your music i love it as well but what is my option the option is to give this person um enough weaponry or ammunition like i said to pull this channel down moving forward um i've spoken with some other reactors and they said i have to start pausing my music reactions now you know when i, I started this channel 2020 and i have never never paused a song i just love listening to the whole song at one go pausing takes away Oh, even the thought of it, it just, it kind of steals my joy in a bit, but I, I think that is what I have to do to keep, you know, the copyright strikes or claim, because when they say when you pause, it might remove the, you know, the claim on it, or potentially you won't get a strike. If it doesn't work as well, what I'm going to do is that all my music reactions will start going to Patreon. If you're not going to pay for anything, so don't worry. It is completely free. You will just, I will just come over here and tell you, okay, I reacted to this song. Please head over to Patreon and watch it. And you can, you know, enjoy the music. Or I can listen to the music and not put it here and you can play yours side by side because... What are the options, right? What are the options that I have? The backup channel is good, maybe because it's a smaller channel, so it hasn't been targeted with the strikes. I, I, all the songs, I put them up over there and nothing happened. So I, I really feel like this channel was just targeted by someone and I know who the person is, my patrons know who it is, and I just wanna keep you guys updated and abreast with what's been going on behind the scenes and just like i said again thank you so much for your patience and understanding um a couple just patience is all i need one strike is going to be off this month of december the other strike is going to be out three um january so it's going to be it, each strike takes three months to um disappear um and i have to make sure that i don't get any more strikes in the meantime so that's why I'm totally avoiding music till the strikes are out completely, right? So that's, I just wanted to explain that to you guys. All right, let's get into our movie reaction. We've got Firefly and this is Serenity. That's the first, it says pilot film. All right, first time watching it, first time watching. Back just far enough. And what'd you mean here? Bendis, give us some cover fire. We're going duck hunting. The lion said they were gonna waltz through Serenity Valley, and we choked them with those words. Our angels are gonna soar in overhead, rain and fire on those arrogant cars. So you hold. You hold. Go. Ready? Always. Oh 
Zoe. Mm. We're gonna die. We're not gonna die. We can't die, Ben. <laughs> we are just too pretty for God to let us die. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Zoe! Tell the 80 seconds. They're not coming. Are you kidding me? How can they do that to them? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, they shot him. They shot Be Bendis. What's his name? Bendis? Okay, I'm gonna boil it. Jane, give me the stick. Okay, we get the goods. We're off this rack and back on the ship. No worries. I like how they're using Western music for for out of space, like Western. So it's a fertile land, and we will thrive. We will rule over all this land, and we will call it this land. <laughs> Captain, we got incoming Alliance cruiser bearing right down on us. So mad, eh? Have they spotted us? Watch. Shut it down now. Everything but the air. Bob, shoot out the thunder. Okay, now I can't get down. No point in checking for survivors? So they're stealing from spaceships. They're like pirates. Sir, there is a reading on that thing. Do a sweep. Uh-oh. Yahoo, are they? Engaging the crybaby. Definitely a big ship, sir. Watch, we're on, go! Hang on, travelers. I put out a bulletin on the cortex and flag Interpol, a firefly with possible stolen goods on board. Oh, firefly. That's what they call them. Oh. I love. Well, there we are. Risk. Yeah, that was pretty risky sitting dead there. But we best be getting rid of these before we run into another line control. We're down to the wire on fuel cells. We run hot. We might not even make. Contact Badger till my job's done. Don't go to mentioning the cruiser, though. No, keep it simple. Tiny. I like to meet new people. They've all got stories. Yeah, I'm being cheerful. Sometimes you just want to duct tape her mouth and dump her in the hole for a month. <laughs> we can only use a couple days leave. What if we just told now we need a couple of days instead of asking him? <sighs> Is that where you studied? To be a companion? I was born there. Study to be a companion? Is that what they call it? Uh, oh. My father is very influential. We could, I could arrange for you to be. We're touching down at the Eaves Down docks in about 10 minutes. What's going on? Eaves Down docks. Listen, the companion Walsh well, is the dinosaur guy, husband to the beautiful, full lipped. I didn't catch her name, but I'm learning their names. I'm learning their names. Be patient with me. We've got Captain. They kill Bedness. We've got Kaylee, who's always happy. Walsh and Nora, the companion. I'm still learning their names. Uh, this shouldn't take too long. Just down for departure in about three hours. Get us some passengers. Them as can pay, all right? Compression coil bus, we're drifting. It's not bus then. You want a trip, Grandpa? You need safe passage? We're cheap. We're cheap. We're clean. I uh, never married. Not a grandpa. <laughs> I never married. Well, you don't have to be married to be a grandpa. <laughs> so unless you're telling us you're a virgin, <laughs> anything can happen. Yes. We're late. Means you're looking to put us on the defensive right up front. Which means something's gone. You got here sooner. You might have beaten the bulletin that came up saying Rogue Vessel Classification Firefly. It's no deal. No that deal. ain't fair. Only fluid I see here is a puddle of piss refusing to pay us our wage. What were you in a war? That big war you failed to win. Oh. I'm above you. Better oh. than oh. businessman, see? You're like ships. You don't seem to be looking at the destinations. What you care about is the ships and 
Mine's the nicest. I'm a shepherd from the South Down Abbey. Book. I'm called Book. Well, I'm Kaylee. And this here's Serenity. And she's the smoothest ride from here to Boros for anyone. Ooh, Lion sketches us with government goods. We'll lose the ship. That's never gonna happen. Jane, your mouth is talking. You might want to look to that. I'm ready to stop talking. Whatever. Right, though. Sir, we don't want to deal with patients again. Why not? She shot you. Well, yeah, she did a bit. Still. So we find somebody else. Or Mr. No, Doc. Thanks. We're gonna keep our heads down. Do the job. Please be careful with that. Mal, this is Simon. Simon, this is our captain. An hour just in time. Let me guess, we're in a hurry. To help me prepare something. You're a shepherd. I thought the outfit gave it away. You're welcome to visit the dining area anytime. Apart from that, I have to ask you to stay in the passenger dorm while we're in the air. Convenience, unfortunately. We've been ordered by the Alliance to drop some medical supplies off on white phone. It's okay. Oops, sorry. Do you see that the way that guy was putting something in his bag? It's almost like he was blind. He was looking straight, but, or he was trying to, he was hiding, you know, I don't know. His eyes were. Ah, the ambassador graces us with her presence. Hello, Mal. Well, I wasn't expecting to see a state official either. Ambassador's Mal's ways. She's a whore, Shepard. Don't you want to meet the rest of the bunch? Why don't you make sure they want to meet me first? Oh my God, that was rude. That was rude, Captain Sergeant Malcolm Reynolds. I don't know why he said that. Yes, what's in the box? Let me see. Strawberries? Mind if I say grace? Only if you say it out loud. You're a doctor, right? Oh, ah, uh, yes, I was a trauma surgeon on Osiris in Capital City. Oh, Kaylee here just wishes you was a gynecologist. <laughs> Don't keep a civil tongue in that mouth or I will sew it shut. I was just wondering what his job is on the ship. Public relations. If I'm intruding... Not at all. I expected you. Oh. The captain said you might like it. I was surprised at his concern. For a lowly whore? Right. Well, you might want to get up here. Signal! Somebody went on the cortex hailed the nearest Alliance cruiser. Tell me you scrambled it. What the hell? I don't know how much got through. Forget your toothpaste? You're not supposed to come here without you any... out of your mind? You're a lunatic. You're a Goran fed. Hate to say it, Captain. But you've got the wrong man. Son of a bitch. Drop that fire. The doctor. Oh. Hey. Is there, is there a reward? You're carrying a fugitive across interplanetary borders. And you think I actually believe you're bringing medical supplies to Whitefall? Back off! Take the key! Get your hands off! Get the hell down! Stop it! Stop it! Oh my god! Kaylee! Don't tell me! Huh. Can you move your feet? Uh, Kaylee, stay with me. Stay with me. Can you move your feet? Captain, we've been hailed by a cruiser. Ordered to stay on course and dock for prisoner transfer. You think your lives are the only thing that matters? What you do? Kill your folks with a family fortune? I don't. Who cares? Enough! Now do it. Don't you ever tell me what to do on me. Do you have an extractor? Got a laser saw? No, that's not good enough. Uh, my room, red bag. Oh, Look at the beast. He's also watching. I want to know what's going on here. Well, then why don't we find out? What do you. No! His sheet, his um box. What's in his um No passwords, nothing? No code? Well, oh, just open it up. A man like you would kill for. What? Well, I hope it's not things that he needs to use for future whatever. Like if it's irreplaceable, if the What's that? Is that a person? Oh <gasps> Was this one for you? Is it true love? 
Because you do seem a little... <laughs> Safe, I'm here. Can somebody give her something to wear? What the hell is this? You should have asked before you open it up. This is my sister. So when I tell you that my little sister makes me look like an idiot child, I want you to understand my full meaning. Music, math, theoretical physics, even, even dance. There was nothing that didn't come as naturally to her as breathing does to us. A government-sponsored academy, we had never even heard of it, but it had the most exciting program, the most challenging. I got a few letters at first, and then I didn't hear for months. She talked about things that never happened, jokes that, that we never... It was a code. They're hurting us. Get me out. Kaylee comes through, you and your sister get off at Whitefall. If she doesn't come through? Well, then you're getting off at White sooner. What is it that makes you so afraid of the Alliance? You don't want to go down this road with me, boy. I do, girl. They have punched you once too many. You have to... Now, I gotta know how close the Alliance is. Exactly how much you told them before Wash scrambled your call. Mm-hmm. He was not specific as to how. <laughs> You gotta scare him. Pain is scary. Just do it right. <laughs> pain is scary. Is that pain is scary? I mean, how much say now? They know everything. They know every name, every record. They know how many nose hairs you've got. Ah, oh, see, I ain't don't know a damn thing. It's all over your face. I ain't even. Well, don't they teach you how to withstand interrogation? <laughs> you can't even tell a damn lie. Okay. <laughs> If you help me out, you'll have enough to buy your own ship. Reavers. Passing on the ship. Looks to be Reavers. When we try to run, they'll have to chase us. It's their way. I don't understand. You never heard of Reavers? No. no. Count us to death, eat our flesh and sew our skins into their clothing. And if we're very, very lucky, they'll do it in that order. She said rape us to death, eat our flesh, and sew, their, sew, our, sew the skin to their clothing. Girl, you better have poison in that box to kill yourself or something. What do you have in there? There's a magnetic grappler that could hold us from Just tell me if they alter course. I didn't see them. Hello, Kaylee. What's the news? I'm shiny. Can't be okay. I hope she she's not paralyzed or anything, you know? Like, it's just a belly run. I hope she, it didn't... Uh, I'm not. It's nobody's fault. Okay? Just promise me you remember that. You just gotta have faith in people. Kaylee's very dear to all of us. Uh, I'm sorry for my part in what happened. Oh. What are you doing in my shuttle? It's my shuttle. You rent it. Then when I'm behind on the rent, you can enter unasked. Kaylee's dead. Eh? No, she's not. No, she's not. She just fainted. I'm being psychotic. <laughs> <laughs> Malcolm Reynolds? Well, patience? I have to say, I didn't look to be hearing from you anytime soon. Besides, your days of fighting over salvage rights are long behind you. What I hear, what are you, mayor now? I upload coordinates for a rendezvous point outside of town. See you in the world. Sir, so we don't have to deal with her. Yes, we do. Here's a little concept I've been working on, though. Why don't we shoot her first? We'll get through this. We will. Nice place for an ambush. That it is. You're coming through good and loud. Because I'm standing right here. Yeah, well, but the transmitters. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
You like taking a walk around the park? Sure you don't just want to piss yourself and back down like you did with Badger? Mm-mm. Come on, book. Don't Mr. Book Shepherd. Um... I believe you're in more danger. <laughs> And you were coming to help him. He says, I believe you're in more danger. He was coming to help him and you knocked him out. Serves you right, book. Thank you. Is that Zoe? You still sailing this old boat? Awful lot of men to haul three crates. Oh. Oh. Sure, patient. One of those will feed a family for a month. Longer. Oh. They don't like their kids too well. Yep. That's the stuff. Oh, so those were bars of food. That I thought it was like copper or like. Look at you. All woke up. Oh, I'm sorry about what happened before, but make so much as a sound. The next one goes through your throat. I've made out on this deal. Don't complicate things. I got a rule. I never let go of money I don't have to. Right. Nice hat. Oh my god! No! Zoe! Armor's dented. Well, you're right about this being a bad idea. Thanks for saying, sir. Mal, don't you take another step! I do the job. And then I get paid. And take your food with you. No. Well, don't even give her the washed. food. We got ship coming in. They followed us. The Gorham Reapers followed us. I guess they got hungry again. Oh my goodness gracious. If you could do that, you could kill a lawman in cold blood. Oh, listen. Listen, we are way past that now. Leave him for reverse. They're hungry. They need an offering. Oh, come on. Coming Where the fast. hell are you guys? There's nowhere you can take her, the law won't find. Nobody is going to hurt her. I'm not playing anymore. Boy. Anybody makes so much. <laughs> Yes, we're done with this nonsense. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Yes, my plan. They followed my plan. I'm so happy. You leave him for something since you're so bent on being nonsense. Annie Kaylee in the engine room, please. Can she even get her in there now? Now, don't you? We get boarded. You take off. Head for town. We might be able to stop them from following you. They'll kill you. No. We're ready for full throw on the mark. Oh my god. Even the thing chasing them looks like a... Like a demonic spider. Okay. There's something you can't do. In the opposite direction. Ooh! That's a whole lot of you guys, but you're escaping. <laughs> Ain't no way they can come around in time to follow us now. Sir, I'd like you to take the helm, please. I need this man to tear all my clothes off. Yes, girl! I told you. <laughs> He deserves that. Make him turn all shades of red. <laughs> he was great. Is this what life is out here? Falling in with criminals. Oh. I watched the captain shoot the man I swore to protect. Girl, don't offer him anything. He just wants to pray. And in not that kind of way.
<laughs> just give the man of God a moment. <laughs> just let him chill. Let him relax. He doesn't need anything else. <laughs> when the lawman got out of his room, you haven't tied him up so well and all. But he did try to make a deal with you, right? Yes. Money wasn't good enough. <laughs> what happens when it is? Well, may it become apparent to you that the ship could use a medic. A bright yard, top 3%, but he ain't weak, and that's not nothing. Half the people on the ship have been shot or wounded, including yourself, and you're harboring known fugitives. That's not much. And your food. That's enough. Okay, and that was the pilot. I enjoyed it. Yes, yes, it was really good. Love the soundtrack. Love the costumes. Love the spaceship that they have. Very um, <laughs> broke looking, but put together. I'm enjoying the characters. So far, I am all for Zoe and um, Kaylee. Zoe is gorgeous. Gina Torres. Um, I don't know Casey's real name. Um, who else do I like? Kaylee. Sorry, I said Kaylee is her name. So I was writing down because I, I like to remember their names. So the place that they all, where the ships were all docking, I saw that it was Persephone. And the name of their ship is Serenity. And we have the surgeon who was, he was a former surgeon. He's now the captain of the ship, Malcolm Reynolds. That guy, Bedness, is already dead. So I don't need to remember. Um, Kaylee is one of the engineers. She's very good with the engine. Um, Walsh, who likes dinosaurs, is married to Zoe. And he's the pilot. Honora is the companion. Um, we've got the passengers. Oh, we've got James, who's like the bodyguard, you know, the violent, the one who does all the violence. Then the passengers we got were the Shepherd Book, Lawrence Dobbs, who we just threw out. Um, the Doc is Simon. He has a sister, River, who we've gotten their story. They're geniuses, maybe child medical, you know, prodigies. They're really they're geniuses. Let's just keep it that way. And they they the sister was so much smarter than him and somehow found herself in a facility where you know they under the guise the facility was supposed to improve you know people make a scholarship of sorts to educate them on more smart stuff and it so happened that they messed her brains up and she's still trying to recover from whatever experiments they did on her i'm not so sure then we've got um who else that's it. I think I touched on everyone, right? Yes, I did. And I didn't like that old woman that tried to kill him again after instilling. Well, you know what? It's the time. So I have to realize that the, the, the timing of everything, we've got the demons on ship reverse who rape, kill, and they're cannibals. My name is Hannibal Lecter. So that's it. Who else, who else did we, did I leave out in this whole thing? Um, I, well, I'm, I'm just, this is the first time watching, so I'm catching up on everything. Um, I would like to know why I have a couple of, well, just a couple of questions, but let me just, I don't want to stop and come back to that like when it's still fresh. Why didn't they, in the beginning, they were expecting people to come and save them. I want to know why they eventually gave up. That's one. When that time they were crossing, the, the, the Serenity was crossing um, reverse. Did they have to turn out all their engine power to make sure that they were not raising signals to that ship? That's another thing. If reverse is going around roaming, roaming, how come they didn't dock at Persephone? Well, why didn't they dock there? Is their own? Do they just not want to land on any planet? They just want to keep roaming the space and capturing people. Is that what it is? So they never really dock. That's another question that I have. Um. What else? What else? So that's it. I, the more I watch, I guess the more I'll learn. But those are the questions that I have right now. Oh, and another question that I had was, what is up between the captain and Honora? Like, what is going on there, the companion? 
obviously they seem to have must have had a relationship something she must have done that he can't seem to forgive um i think it's gonna have to because i'm going off you know what you're watching movies and building up maybe he didn't agree with her lifestyle or with what she calls her profession and can't understand why she has to share herself with other people and didn't like that didn't like that you know she did that i'm guessing that could be it and can't although he loves her he cannot continue he can't get over it he can't get over it right i i've seen stories and watched movies where the man is madly in love with a woman and found out that oh she used to be a stripper and he's like oh my god i don't love you anymore you're not the same person his choice he has to live with that decision but if he's tormenting himself because he still loves her and he's tormenting her because he can't get over it and he's being rude you know like when he called her the ambassador the ambassador and you know the um book shepherd the shepherd book was um he sort of was giving her that respect and he was like no i don't mean ambassador in that sense i mean she's a whore I was like, well, goodness, that term, though, you know, that was just so vile and insulting. So let me know what's going on there. Or maybe don't tell me, let me watch it. But those are the questions that I'm having in my mind. Don't answer any of my questions because it's going to be a spoiler for me. And I, I'm really enjoying the first one. So these, these are the things that I'm thinking about, but I know I'm going to learn. I hope I learn and the, I get the answers to them by the time I go further into the episodes. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell, consider becoming a patron so you can watch the full length reactions. And I hope, I hope you stick around to watch more. On to the next.